Hey guys and welcome to my first English tutorial. Today I will draw a Lego map in Inventor 2015. So I have the design sketches here. You can see that I have all the parts that I need in order to make this uh, space map. Okay, so I will start with the head now. Okay, go on, open your inventor. I use Inventor Professional 2015 for this, but you can use any CAD program that supports 3D design. Go make a part because we will uh, design the first, like the parts, and afterwards we need to assemble it in order to get like the movements and everything. So go on, make a 2D sketch. Select the XY plan. So how we can see here, we have multiple circles that uh, we need to draw them because afterwards you have to extrude it in order to get this shape here in the top right corner. You see it's like a cylinder, so the easy part it will be to start with the circles that you need and you see here. Okay, go here, make a circle. The first it will be 12 millimeters. After you draw the circle, you need to exit the sketch. In the top menu, you can see we have different uh, tools for 3D. So go ahead and choose extrude. And now the value, the value for this one, it will be one millimeters because this one is the part here, the, the small one, the base of the head. And afterwards, we have to do, draw the big one. So go ahead and make a circle with a diameter of 20 millimeters here. So go ahead, make a new sketch on the top of the other one. Go ahead, a circle. But you need to take care because you have to do the circles on the same line. So you have to have co concentric circles. So go ahead, put 20 millimeters here, exit the sketch, extrude the circle again, and this it will be a little bit hard if you don't know like how to read the technical drawing. So go back to the drawing, and here you can see that we have 21 from the bottom to the top of the head, but we have the extrude for one millimeter and four millimeters, so 21 minus 5, it will be 16 millimeters for the biggest part. And here you have 16. Okay. Now we need this small part that is uh, here on the top and it's 10 millimeters in diameter. So go ahead again, a new 2D sketch, circle on the same center and 10 millimeters finish the sketch extrude it again and this time four millimeters and guys this is like like our head you can see like a three different cylindricals go back home and now we have this pilot here on the top and on the bottom two millimeters so go ahead and do that and here at the top you can see pilot click on it select the edges the bottom one and the top one go ahead put two millimeters and here you can see the preview of it go ahead and click ok and now you can see the the pilots on the corners really nice go back to the sketch we have a hole here with 10 millimeters in diameter and 15 millimeters in deep so go back on this plate make a new 2d sketch a new circle and this should be 10 millimeters finish sketch and now you have more uh, options for you to make the hole you can use the hole button here in the 3D menu or you can use extrude. I'm gonna use extrude because I think it's easy. I don't know. Depends on you guys. Go ahead, type 15 because that is the length. Choose the cut here in the left menu. 
and the opposite direction. And here you can see the preview of the hole with like the dimensions and everything. Go ahead, click OK. And that's it. The head is finished. OK, for the fun, I will just make it yellow. And here you can see like the finished part of our head for the Lego man. It's pretty nice. Okay, okay guys, thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next parts for our Lego man. See you.